everybody, it's the Masked Lantern, and welcome back to Banjo-Kazooie! We are now on to the next level of Banjo-Kazooie. So we are first going to go in here. So I love Ben. We're back with Banjo-Kazooie, playing the game, fighting everyone, beating everyone down, and we are going to the newest level called... Let's go here. Clanker's Cap. Um... Can we just... Okay, no, that's not what I want to do. Seriously, how do I get all of them? If you want to place... Thank you, thank you. Uh-huh. I am hitting the right trigger. Thank you. We're going to... Da -da 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 Boom! Clanker's Cavern. So, let's go over there right now, and let's get to Clanker's Cavern. Now i got a question to ask all of you, and leave this in the comments, please. Do you guys mind going through the beginning of Gruntilda's Castle, or, well, Lair, I should say, and I went to, and I went to the wrong place. Do you mind going through the Lair, uh, beginning of every video, or would you much rather, uh, start, like, at the level, like, I already unlocked it or anything, and we just go? Leave it in the comments of which one do you prefer, and I'll do that. So... Clanker's Cavern's over there, and we can't get to it yet, but we have to do this. Bam! And then these raise up like that. And then Gruntilda will not talk to us. Oh my goodness, it's a, it's a miracle. Uh, I miss her now. I miss you, Gruntilda! Speak to me! My love! I want a divorce now from her. She's evil. Well, literally she is. Now we're going to come over here and hit this one, and then that one will, um, that one will come up. Because we'll need that later. We need to remember that later. So... We're gonna go in here to do, 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 do. welcome to Clanker's Cavern. Now, like always, we gotta start off and listen to that music. Oh wait, no bottles. All right. So, like I said, now we can listen to music real quick. All right, that's good enough music. This level I remember playing as a child was awesome. It's like all decrepit and grody, and then but then these things come out, and you go fuck you. I'll, I'll show you what they actually look like, and not kill one. And get close. That's what they actually look like. Those things. And then now we kill. Okay, I actually didn't think we were gonna kill you that time. But um, I remember this level being cool and grody. Up. Oh, what do you say? Alright, so bottles will tell us more about you. So, this place being dark and depressing and grody and just... Oh, it, look, it looks awesome. But the thing that um, I remember most about this level is who this level is named after. Clanker. Now, when we get to Clanker, you're... Some of you are going to think he's really awesome looking and others of you are going to think, Oh, God. Oh, God, because Clanker is interesting. That's all I'm gonna say. But we'll see. You'll see Clanker very quickly because we gotta get all of these things right here. Because this water is basically consisting of water. Mo mo actually, the majority of it is water. Like right now, we gotta swim real quick. Swim, swim. So I know it's been a long, long time since I released a video, and I apologize. I've just been very busy. Here over in the United States, because um, I don't know, because who you know, you know, I don't know if this video is gonna go worldwide. But if it does, in the United States, Thanksgiving time, where it's time to spend with family, those who annoy you and those who you love. Now it's time to meet Clanker. See that mouth? Oh, it's in a lovely mouth. Now Clanker. Now. This is Clanker, a giant shark. Yes, you heard me, a giant shark. The difference between this shark, he's also mechanical. But the problem about Clanker is he's not really a bad guy. When you first look at him, you think, a uh, bad guy. He's not. He, unfortunately, and he will tell us this as well, he's unfortunately Gruntilda's car uh, garbage can, basically, or disposal. Okay, we gotta come down here. There's Gloop. 
I think his name is Blue. Yeah, Blue. Because he gives us air to be down here so he can breathe. Now we gotta come over here real quick. Those bubbles right there. If we get them, if we get them, we can breathe. So, swim. It's hard to get these things. Okay, it's hard to get the bubbles from Blue. Okay. Oh, he actually burps them out. Okay. I mean, that doesn't help any. That doesn't help, like, you know, anything. So we're gonna come in here real quick and just stick right... Okay, no. No. We're gonna come in over... Come over here. We need to get this key... Get. We need this key to move... Oh, God. Nope. Let's go get that bubble real quick. This is gonna take us a while to do because it's so hard to do it. Anyways, like I said, Thanksgiving time here in the Mask Lantern household. Family's in town, so yay for that. Alright, here we go. We just stay here. Okay. Whoop. Ah, uh, here we go. Yep, see, if you take these bubbles, you'll give you more air, like I said. Okay, let's ignore that bubble because it's going up too fast. So let's get this bubble. We gotta find a way to get. We have to make this key turn because it's the only way that's gonna let us get Clanker, and we kind of need Clanker for the rest of the level. So there we go. I had to go the other way. All right, here we go. Here we go. Now Clanker will rise up. See? There you go, buddy. There you go. And he'll be all happy now too. As he comes up out of the disgusting murky water, and we get our first Jiggy. Yeah. Now let's come up. Alright, so thank you, Clanker. Now this level made me extremely nervous. Even, like, not as nervous as Snacker did. But if you get down there, if you go down where Gloop is, and forget about your air, and then you realize, like, when you have, like, only a little bit left, and you just, like, and then you just start panicking. Now, What's confusing about Clanker, and a lot of people have brought this up, with those who play this game and done reviews and things like this, Clanker's a uh, machine. You can clearly see his metal outlook and stuff, but yet he has wounds and blood and things. It's it's kind of nerve-wracking, really, that he has all that. So we're going to collect all you real quick and get, get that, and then we're going to get you. And we're gonna get you now. All right, there we go. Yay, we got our first Jiggy of this world. All right, what's up, Clanker? Okay, we'll do that as well. We'll help We'll help you out with your teeth as well, buddy. Clanker, you're a good guy. You're a good guy to be, Clanker. I like you. You're not, not, oh God, we're swimming now. You're nothing like Snacker. Snacker's an asshole. I hate Snacker. Ugh, God. Just, just thinking about Snacker makes me Ugh. All right, uh, so we got a face and hit hit that one individual too. We knock it down like that. All right, so we got to get rid of that too. And now we got to get rid of that too. Now they're gold, so that makes it a lot easier to point out. So be really, it might be hard to see, but you got to look at it very carefully to see it's a gold too. All right, boom. Both teeth are knocked down. All right. Yay! Thank you, Bear. Okay, we're gonna go in Clanker's mouth real quick. And we're gonna do this. Now we are in Clanker's mouth. And I believe we needed the other... Yeah, we needed the other mouth. This is inside of Clank. Just letting that sink in. I mean, sink in. Sink. Oh, God. English is, is a difficult language. So, we're gonna swim. We're gonna get out of Clanker. And look at all this disgusting thing. It's like, again, he's a robot, but look. Things just growing out of him, and oh god, yeah, it's, it's weird. It, it's not, it's not normal. It's not right. So we're gonna come over. Can't come up. Can't go up. Okay, there we go. We have to go down here to get out of Clanker. So let's get out of Clanker real quick. Okay, com my commentary isn't amazing, and I know this and things like that. But you gotta understand that you have to think of things off the top of your head just to talk about. I could tell you about what happened to me at work today. Make that quick before this episode's over. So I was at work, minding my own business, 
And then all of a sudden, and I'm not kidding when I say this, the power goes out of my job. It is the funniest thing in the world. And like, so I'm just like, okay, the power's out. What do we do now? And my boss is just like, you know, it's like, well, we keep working. It's like, okay. Because, I mean, it, the power was off, but yet it was on. Because we apparently have a backup generator that only works for half of the store, which I think is hilarious. Only half the store can get this generator. And what I mean by this, I don't mean like half the store was lit and half the store was dark. I mean, like, so there were a few lights that were on. And that, you know, the more important things had, you know, lights for, well, had power for them. Like the refrigerator and things like that. But I mean, still, just why do only half the store get this and not all the store? Can you not afford a giant generator? But yeah, power goes out. And then I come home after a long day at work. And then the power at home goes out. So it's just like, so I was without power for maybe about four hours altogether, two hours at work, two hours at home. It probably was a lot shorter, but I mean, it felt like four hours. It really did. So we're going to come down and spoosh. Splash, splash, I was taking a bath. Boom, 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 boom. Kill you, sir. All right, so I'm going to leave this video right here. So thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, do all that stuff. And like always, I shall see you in the next video. This is the Mass Lantern. Bye-bye!